A tragedy in Warren leaving the town shaken up. Two are dead, another man injured following a shooting at a social club. The victim, Brian Remy, is the town's assistant fire chief. 12 News reporter Brittany Schaefer joins us live now from the station with how the department is remembering one of their own. Brittany? Well, Mike and Fire Chief James Sousa says the department is a true family, and yesterday they suffered an immense loss. Today, if you look back behind me, Assistant Chief Brian Remy's jacket lays across the truck he rode in hundreds of times. Black bunting is draped across Warren's fire station in honor of Assistant Chief Brian Remy. He would do anything for anybody. The 40 year Warren fire veteran was shot and killed inside the Italian American Club on Kelly Street. Another man, 41 year old Jason Furtado, was also shot. The gunman, police say, is the club's president, 37 year old Michael Ouellette. Ouellette was found in a nearby alley after shooting at a Warren police officer, the incident rattling the small town. We're all shaken up. We're nervous to even go out. Longtime resident Vicki Kenna knows Furtado and says he is expected to be okay. He's a loving father, um, loving husband, and just a really free spirited guy who deserved none of this. And I'm so sorry for the Remy family. Fire Chief James Souza says Remy didn't just volunteer at the department, but owned a plumbing company and volunteered in numerous events around town, like the clam bake. He saw a need, he found a way to make it happen. It's for the community. You, know, you can stop at any any business in town, or any uh, there's anybody that won't say they never called on him in an emergency. His uh, commitment to the town is unwavering. And Chief Sousa tells me Remy's funeral arrangements are being planned today, but no official date has been released at this time. For now, Ivan Warren and Brittany Schaefer, 12 News. Tonight, there is shock and sorrow here in Warren following the death of longtime firefighter Brian Remy, who was shot and killed at a social club yesterday afternoon. Meantime, questions remain about what sparked the violence that ended on Water Street with the, suspect, the suspected gunman dead. 12 News reporter Brittany Schaefer joins us now from Warren with the latest. Well, it's a somber day in Warren as the town mourns the loss of their assistant fire chief. This morning, the fire department laid black bunting across the station here to honor Brian Remy. Assistant Fire Chief Brian Remy's uniform draped on Tower One along with a small memorial. His colleagues describing the 40 year department veteran as someone who would do anything for anyone. His uh, commitment to the town is unwavering, his commitment to the department and the members of the department. Second to none. He saw a need, he found a way to make it happen. The 66 year old was shot to death inside the Italian American Club on Kelly Street Thursday afternoon. Another man, 41 year old Jason Furtado, was also shot but is expected to be okay. Police say the suspect, Michael Ouellette, is the president of the club. They say the 37 year old opened fire on officers. The officer then immediately took cover and returned fire. After the exchange of gunfire was happening, the subject entered 135 Water Street in the alley. He was later pronounced deceased at the scene. Fire Chief James Sousa tells us Remy was heavily involved around town. He says he owned Remy's plumbing and heating and black bunting hung on the business's sign Friday. A lot of our calls sometimes, just the experience in his business, he was able to offer a solution. Police say this is the town's first homicide in a decade, and they've never had anything happen to this extent. Longtime resident Vicki Kenna says it's left the town on edge. It's uh, horrible. We're all shaken up. We're nervous to even go out. And I spoke to Remy's family today. They declined to go on camera, but do tell me they are coping as best as they can and are in shock this happened so suddenly. In Wharton, I'm Brittany Shaper, 12 News.